They ask us for the equation of a line that passes through the two points. And to properly solve this, there's two things we need to know. The slope, which we could use the formula y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. And we need to know the point slope formula, which is y minus y1 is equal to m times x minus x1. Now, when we plug in the information for the slope, m is going to be equal to 7 minus 3 over 2 minus negative 1. So m is going to be equal to positive 4 over 3. So just based off the slope, answer choice 1 and answer choice 3 are eliminated. Now when we go in, it looks like they use the first point, 2, 7, to create the equation. So we're going to focus on that point. So using the point slope formula, we should have y minus the y value, which is 7. And this is equal to our slope, 4 over 3 times x minus the x value, which is 2. When we look at answer choice 2 and answer choice 4, we notice that the correct answer is answer choice 4. Now, for some reason, they want you guys to create the whole equation as in simplify. We just need to distribute for the first step. So we have 4 over 3x minus 8 over 3. Now when we add 7, we have y is equal to 4 over 3x minus 8 over 3 plus 7. But as a fraction, we could rewrite 7 as 21 over 3. And then we just need to combine our like terms. So when we simplify, the equation will be y is equal to 4 over 3x plus 13 over 